It was the summer of 2010. Uh, that was the summer that the Deepwater Horizon, the offshore drilling rig, uh, exploded in the Gulf of Mexico. And for three months, the thing was spewing oil into the ocean, uh, devastating the local ecology. And I remember being on the highway at the time uh, in Toronto and turning on the radio, the host, the guests, the callers, they were all blaming BP, shame on BP. And as I sat there, there were seven lanes going east, seven lanes going west, thousands upon thousands of vehicles within eyesight, all burning fuel that had to come from somewhere underneath the earth. And it was then that I realized that there's this complete disconnect. A couple of years later, I had a phone call with my grandfather and it was the last few words that he ever spoke to me. You have to enjoy what you're doing, Rob. Do what you love. He passed away shortly after that. They, they prompted me to, to close down my legal practice and to launch this idea into the world. Uh, a couple years later, and this idea is being supported by local governments across Canada. I think a few years from now, we will look back on this and say, why didn't we do it sooner? It was so obvious, so simple, uh, so inexpensive. It's an idea when you really take the time to, to learn it, uh, I think you'll realize that it's one of the most compelling climate change interventions there is. This is an idea that will change the world.